good morning all my dear students of class 5 as in the last class we have done uh, some of the important points from the lesson as you can see in the picture rural local self government where i taught you about the meaning of civics and also about few administrative structures of india such as central government then state government then local self government then rural local self government then also about urban local self government also i taught you about rural local self government and panchayati raj <coughs> as well as uh, i discussed i already already discussed with you organization of the village panchayat so let's start from organization of village panchayat so uh, almost uh, all big villages in india have a gram sabha a gram panchayat and a naya panchayat let us understand the function of each so as you can see in the picture the, uh, the uh, paragraph is all about the gram sabha now what is a gram sabha the meaning of gram in gaon or village and the meaning of sabha means meeting so let me read the paragraph first then i will make you understand the gram sabha literally literally means a meeting of the village this is the first tier of the panchayat at the village level all adult men and women in a village who have reached the age of 18 are the members of the gram sabha thus the gram sabha may be termed as the general body of the villages this body represents the true democratic functioning of the panchayati raj system the membership can be anywhere between 100 and 1000 the gram sabha holds meeting twice a year and important matters are discussed in this general body meeting now what it is written about gram sabha that gram sabha is all about a meeting on the village this is the first tier of the panchayat and uh, at the village level all adult men and women it means those who reach the age of 18 are the members of the gram sabha thus the gram sabha may be termed as the general body of the village this body represent the true democratic functioning of the panchayati raj system the membership can be anywhere between it means the total number of members should be in between anywhere in between 100 to 1000 the gram sabha holds meeting twice a year twice a year the gram sabha holds a meeting and important matters are discussed in this general body meeting so normally the gram sabha is all about the meeting in a meeting of a village where the members must have age uh, above 18 and it helps twice in a year and the membership can be uh, membership can be anywhere between 100 and 1000 the next point we will learn about the gram panchayat now what is a gram panchayat gram as you people know that uh, gram means a village and panchayat uh, it's all about the five people the panch so we will learn about this in the paragraph so let me read the paragraph first then i will make you understand the members of the gram sabha elect a small committees of member from among themselves to form a village panchayat each panchayat is divided into smaller areas called wards each ward elects a representative known as panch the members of the gram sabha directly elect a sarpanch who is the panchayat president the number of the members of the gram panchayat may vary from state to state may the members may be different from state to state the village panchayat looks after the various problems of the villagers and takes steps to improve the condition of the village so what are the what is the work of the village panchayat is look up after the various problems of the villagers and take steps to improve their conditions the gram panchayat look after the social economic and cultural needs of the village and traditionally settles disputes between the people and the gram panchayat looks what is the work of gram, gram panchayat it looks after the social economic and other cultural matters of the village and try to traditionally solve uh, solve the disputes between them between the people the gram panchayat can be set up in a village with a population of more than 600 it means a village which consists of 600 people the population is around 600 600 or more than 600 that gram or that gaon can set up a village uh, panchayat okay and if the population is less than 600 then two villages should be mix together join together and they share a common gram panchayat so this is all about the gram panchayat so also some more important things about gram panchayat are there such as the members of the gram panchayat are elected directly by the members of the gram sabha from among themselves on the basis of secret voting a person seeking election to this governing body must be a resident of the village and should be 21 years of age or more it means for giving vote for the selection process of the election process of uh, the gram panchayat a person should be 
should be 21 or more than 21 years of age. He or she must be a member of Ram Sabha or the village assembly too. It is necessary to have women representative and members of the scheduled caste and tribe so that all the members of the society have representatives. So these are the important things of the, the Gram Panchayat. Now, the president or the head of the panchayat is known as the serpent. So, who is known as serpent? Means the president or head of the panchayat is known as the serpent. The other members are known as punch. All the other members are known as punch. The serpent is selected from among the elected members of the gram panchayat. He or she presides over the meeting of the gram panchayat and supervises its work. All its work are supervised by the punch. Implementation of developmental work in the, is the responsibility of the serpent. The deputy serpent who assists the serpent in his work is also elected. The serpent has a term of five years. So as you people know that you know, whenever our uh, uh, Pradhan Mantri, PM or CM, whoever elected in the political organization, they have a particular term of five years. In the same way, serpent also has a term of five years. So in this class, in this class we have learned about the Gram Pancha and the Gram Sama. So I am ending this class. Here in the next class, we will learn about various functions of the Gram Panchayat. Till then, stay safe, stay healthy, take care and bye.